Uh, my name is Gabrielle and I'm here today to uh, help promote CAFE and men, boys and fathers issues. I think it's really important that both uh, men and women work together for equality. I think that um, I think that men need to play a role in women's success, uh, both in the workplace and in the family. And I think that only good can come from working together towards equality. And, and it's ultimately about letting the individual have the choice and, and having as many options for everyone as possible. Well, I came to Canada in December and I feel like there is a lot of inequality in this culture. And I truly believe that men and women should treat each other with respect and honesty. So today, what we are doing at the corner of Dundas and Young is uh, raising awareness to these issues of equality for everyone. These issues affect everyone, society as a whole, and we aim to educate and uh, bring these issues to light in the public. We are a charitable organization and we look forward to opening the first men's and family centre here in Toronto. And I've been a part of CAFE for about a year now, um, Canadian Association for Equality. Um, I've been interested in equal rights and uh, the issues with equal rights in Canada for a lot longer than that, but um, I was introduced to CAFE last year through a video on YouTube and I've been a part of CAFE since. Um, I volunteer with them um, as well as uh, join their seminars and lectures. Um, the reason I'm here today is because um, I'm here to support equal rights in Canada for both men and women and that actually includes transgenders, um, homosexual communities, bisexual communities. Uh, we are here to support equality for everyone. It's not one versus another, it's not to support one or the other, it's actually for everyone. Um, I've been talking to people out there and you hear a lot of interesting stories and a lot of people are getting interested in, in this association and one of the stories I heard today was a gentleman that was speaking about how for the past 19 years he's been trying to be a part of uh, his daughter's life and he has been and he fought for joint custody and he just couldn't get it because he ran out of money because legal fees are so expensive in Canada and uh, he basically fought as far as he could. Um, a lot, of, a lot of fathers speak to me and they tell me how they want it to be or they want to be a part of their children's lives and the system just doesn't allow that. And these are healthy, productive, working members of our society who just want to be a part of their children's lives and they're just not given the opportunity. And a lot of times um, I hear stories about how when they have the weekend with the children they're supposed to be given, they're not granted their right by the mother and their former exes, um, and there's nothing they can do about it. Um, they, it's, these are the issues that we try to address. There's also the issue of uh, boys and male uh, suicide rates being four times that of women in, in Canada, which is not really addressed, and that's a huge issue. And other than that, another issue that I'm interested in is the, the male student rates in post-secondary schools is dropping in this country and has been for the past uh, uh, a couple of decades. And that's actually alarming because in the long run, that will create more issues. And that's one of the issues we're trying to address here. And yeah, we, we would love for people to join us. It's a beautiful day out there. We have some great music going on. I support CAFE because it's a, a very good organization who think about uh, the, 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 the issue of um, men and boys inside the family.